what is capitalization? In writing, you often forget about this when you're going along just writing your sentences. It's a step that people forget to take. So here are some rules that you can follow so you make sure you don't forget this. So when do we capitalize? We capitalize the first word in a sentence. So any sentence you start, the first word gets a capital letter. It's just a rule it has been since we've been in learning how to write from day one. Number two, proper nouns. So if you give if somebody has a specific name, uh, the Grand Canyon, that's a proper noun of a place. So that gets a capital letter. Geographic names, as in places. For instance, St. Albans is capitalized and United States is capitalized. The pronoun I. This is one that I see quite often. You think that it's not a proper noun, and it's not at the beginning of a sentence, so why do I capitalize? It's been a rule that we, the I stands alone, we have to capitalize. The names of days and months. Tuesday, October. And then the names, the names of holidays. We'll get a capital letter as well. proper adjectives. Okay, so what's an adjective? An adjective is a word that describes. So, someone might be French, Chinese, English. So if you describe someone with that type of description, it becomes a capital letter. It needs a capital letter. Words used as names. Do you need help, mother? So when you call your mother, mom, dad, etc., your family members, you'll capitalize those in your writing. Titles used before names. So the title of Barack Obama is President. The title of Mr. Smith is Mr. So that becomes capital. The first word in a greeting or closing of a letter. Dear friends, yours truly. And I'd like you to take a quick notice. What comes at the end? That's right. You see a comma because this is a transition. The first, last, and all the main words in the title of a book. Movie, song, magazine, play, newspaper, etc. So, for instance, when you guys are writing your writing pieces, when you put your title, you'll often hear me talk to you about, okay, this is needs a capital, this needs a capital. So this is where that comes in. And the first and last and all the main words. Historical events, documents, and periods of time. So the Boston Tea Party, Declaration of Independence, the Stone Age. So if you're writing historical fiction, that will come into play. The names of organizations, associations, or teams, and their members. So the American Red Cross, the Salem City School Raiders, etc. The names of businesses and brand names, but not the product. Dr. Dr. Prager's veggie burgers, Tom's of Maine toothpaste, um, so products and the actual business that makes it, Lay's potato chips. Potato chips is not going to be capitalized. Initials or abbreviations that stand for names and also abbreviations of titles. Richard T. Smith, MD, Doctor of Medicine, Sachs, St. Albans City School. So think about this in your writing. Are you capitalizing what needs to be capitalized? 